Hey everybody, I was asked to do a beauty tie over and that's what I'm going to do for you today. All I have on is a little bit of BB cream, just a light layer. My skin is super duper red and blotchy and uneven so I just apply a thin layer of BB cream on before I do anything else and I have filled in my brows just a little bit with the blonde menage a brow pin. I'm thinking since I dyed my perimeter, I could probably go up to brunette, but I do really like the blonde. It's a great color. And I lined the underneath of my brow just a little bit with the nude end of our Linum liner, just to kind of do a little highlight on the brow. Okay, so we will start with our eyes. So I'm going to start with the Once You Go Brown Eyes in a Stick. Everybody applies it in a different place. You can do like quite a bit of your lid and smudge it. You can do just a corner of it. It's kind of depending on how much color you want. I usually just kind of do the outer edge and then you just take your finger, whichever finger, and smudge it. Just kind of dot away and press it into your crease. I really like this color of brown. See, just like that. Go to your other eye, do some. It's kind of preference on how you want to do that. These products are very versatile. I actually, one of my favorite lip colors to do, I like a brown neutral eye. And I put this brown eyes at a stick on and then I top it with the light in a stick to lighten it out. And it, to me, it's a perfect nude. I absolutely love it. Um, so you can use these products for more than you think. They're very versatile. Okay, so there's my eyes in a stick, a little bit of color. Then we're going to go with the nude side, the Meet the Parents. I'm going to do that on my waterline. When you put a light color on your waterline, it opens up and brightens up your eyes, gives them more of like a pop. If you have tired eyes or some dark circles or bags under your eyes, this is a great way to take the focus off of those. And then I'm going to go back with the black side, the Catch the Man. And I like to add just a little bit of color right here on the bottom. That's just personal preference. All right, next I'm gonna go to my mascara. Smack my fat lash. It's a one-step mascara. Made for lengthening and thickening. Extremely quick and easy to use. If you're in a hurry and need to get some mascara on and want some nice results, this is the one for you. It draws those babies right out for you.
everybody has different techniques on how they apply their mascara. I've seen people do the little twisty turn thing to draw them up and curl them and I've seen them do the little shimmy to lengthen them out. Kind of whatever works best for you. Everybody's lashes are different and different techniques work best for different people. So. We're going for just a simple, everyday beauty look. Something just to be a nice natural look for the day. That, I'm gonna tell you right now, is something I absolutely love about these products. They are so quick and easy to use. The amount of time I used to spend on my makeup was really ridiculous. And now just a nice little quick brush up. Okay, so there. Just a little mascara. Looks very very nice now I'm gonna go ahead and do my highlight and contour and I do have the light set but I prefer the deep I I tan and I like a more dramatic look so I go with the deep sculpt in a stick so what you do is you just kind of find your cheekbone and you make a little swipe Some go deeper, down, it just kind of depends. You can play around with it and get different looks. So, and you just literally take your finger, no brushes needed, and dab it up. Blend more. I dab with my right hand on both sides. I just, I don't know. When it comes to my left side, I, I can't do anything with it. I'm definitely not, what do you call, ambidextrous. That's not me at all. So, some people like a more dramatic sculpt look. I generally overblend. Um, whoops. Then we come back with our light in a stick. It's like a shimmery highlighting stick, okay? There's different places you can put it. Um, you generally want to put it where the light's going to kind of hit your face and accent your sculpt. So, I generally do down my nose and the crease of my cupid's bow a little on my and then follow right above the line I did for the sculpt and then right here and then see I forgot to do my sculpt on my nose this can this will uh, lengthen out your nose Gives just a little bit of a sleek look. Applies those shadows. Super simple. Take a different finger and blend in that light in the stick. Literally just a few dabs. Oh, 
already you can see like I'm getting a summer glow kind of a look which I absolutely love. Just dab away. And then in the beauty tie over, if you buy it that way, you'll get cheek in a stick, which is a pretty pink color. I like to use the limited edition Staycation cream blush. It's like a real sparkly light pink and you just literally dab your finger in and I just kind of go right along my cheek area and give it a dab. It gives you like a nice sun-kissed sparkle. Just a touch of color in your cheek. My lighting in my bathroom is awful, I apologize. And it is limited edition, and I tell you, a little bit goes a long way, but I'm probably gonna stock up on it because I love this stuff, it's so pretty. Just nice and sparkly. Okay, so we've got my sun-kissed look going on here with my highlight and contouring. Now we're going to go to the lips. This is What Lipstick in Ask for a Raise. It is a matte color of a lipstick and it goes on so smooth and velvety it's amazing. There we go. Ask for a raise. You don't have to, but I like to take my light in a stick. For a little bit of an ombre look. It's my favorite. Always be sure you wipe it off though. You're gonna have it all over your face next time you use it. All right, so that is my beauty tie over super quick and easy i use no tools and just my fingers if you're wanting any of these products you can go to www.fiercemama77.com and get them for yourself oh i almost forgot stick with me spritz it smells like blood orange give your face a little spritz it will stay all day and you feel nice and refreshed and energized because it has that citrusy smell to it. All right, everybody have a good day. That's my beauty tie over. Talk to you later.